Hi everyone, I'm Klim and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you the books I plan on reading in February. So in February I'm continuing the Swithaton and I'm going to link the video here on my TBR for the Swithaton. So most of the books I plan on reading in February are actually books that I have to read for my readathon. The first book I plan on reading this month is Clockwork Prince by Cassandra Clare. So this is the second book in the Infernal Devices trilogy by Cassandra Clare and I already read the first one in January so I'm reading the first one in February and in March I will be reading the third one and the last one so after I can read Chain of Gold but this you already know that because I keep saying it in all my videos so I remember that the first time I read The Clockwork Prince it was my least favorite one so I don't know how this is going to go like am I going to like it better because I reread the first one and actually I don't really like it so is it going to be worse? I don't know, maybe it's going to be better I hope it will be better because what I didn't like with the first one is that it's actually really long and that nothing's happening so hopefully, I know that things are happening in the second one so hopefully I will like it better but who knows this month I also plan on reading Paper Girls Volume 1 so I just talked about this in my recent haul because I just bought it so in this graphic novel you're following uh, five newspaper girls so Dever delivery girls and it's happening in the 80s and on the morning of Halloween they discover some stuff that are really weird like some supernatural stuff, sci-fi stuff and they are actually going to discover that there are weird stuff that are happening in their town so they are going to investigate and I think they are going to be like entangled in all this mystery I feel like so this is said to be uh, made for the Stranger Things uh, fan and I am one so I'm sure I'm going to love it and I can't wait to read it this month I also need to finish It and Complete The Game of Love and Death by Martha Brockenbrot. So I've started this book in December but I had too many work to do so I couldn't really read it. I've read 10 pages I feel like or maybe 30 but so far it's really great, I really like it. So this book is about the competition between love and death uh, in all the love stories. So every like very often uh, love picks a player and death picks a player and they put it together in order to be a couple and they're going to see who is going to win are they going to die like so many like for instance uh, Tristan to Iselt, Romeo and Juliet, Antoni, Antonius and Cleopatra or are they going to be happy and live happily ever after and in uh, this book we're following the couple of uh, Flora and, and Henry and they come from very very different world like uh, it's happening in the 20s and Henry is a very rich and very promising white man and Fiona, because her name is Fiona not Flora, is a black girl who wants to become an aviator but it's really complicated so you see it sounds really interesting, I love the concept of it so I hope I'm going to like it. This month's audiobook is going to be Autobiography by Christine Lorin in this book you're following Tana and Tana is a bisexual teen who moved down from California to Utah. One day his best friend pushes him to participate in a writing contest because apparently he's very good at writing or at least to take a writing class and so Tana does and in his writing class his professor is actually a very cute boy who's older than him and who actually won last year prize, like he won the competition and so Tanner is going to fall in love with him I think and I don't know it's I feel like it's going to be cute like the romance but it also is going to talk about writing and I love reading about writing because I feel like it's a good mix like reading about books and anything so yeah I'm very excited to read this book because a lot of people been talking about it when it first came out and I don't know I feel like I need something cute and I want to read a gay romance so what can I say 
This month I also plan on reading Heartstopper Volume 3 by Ali Sausman. Uh, this is coming out at the beginning of the month and I'm going to London just a few days after. So I'm going to buy it directly and I think I'm going to read it like the night after I bought it. So it's going to be on my TBR and I'm sure I'm going to love it because this time Nick and Charlie are going to Paris and I can't wait to read this and to see where their story is going to go. Like I'm sure there's a lot of drama ahead like because there has to be drama at some point so I can't wait to see where it's going to go. So yeah guys that's it for my favorite TBR. I hope you liked this video. If you did don't forget to like and to subscribe to my channel. Also you can tell me in the comments down below what is your favorite TBR. I would love to know and I will see you next time. Bye guys!